Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for December 30th and 31st, Monday and Tuesday, for my Aquariuses. How are you, my darling Aquarians? I hope that, you know, we're leaving 2019 behind. Let's move on, right? Right. Well, Monday, Tuesday, I use my Radley Valentine Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy, but remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like. Leave the rest. Okay? Okay. I want to wish you all a happy new year. Yes, we are leaving 2019. We're leaving the decade behind. And I do, do feel that 2020 is going to be really a great year, decade for us. Now, of course, we will always have the, um, okay, I don't know why this is coming, but the vagrancy of life, the vagrancy <laughs> of life upon us. And so we do have to deal with things like that. But I'm also feeling, too, that my um, Aquariuses, there's something very intellectually going on with you. There's something very much, um, I mean, you're, you're, there's this intellectual um, connection going on, and it's bringing you into 2020. Okay. Let's see what this is all about. So remember, I'm an intuitive channeler, so I open myself to my higher power, spirit, and I just let whatever needs to come out, come out. No filters. Okay, three cards are face down. Nothing is reversed. Here we go. The page of air. Air is your, your energy. Your, you know, it's your, your sign. It's you. It's Aquarius. It's also Libra, and it's also Gemini. It's hearing news. It's, you know, it's those thought processes that come in. You know, like I was telling you, intellectual, you know, you're balancing. You know, I, I feel like you're looking at a lot of different things. Um, you know, this is, you know, this is kind of like, um, uh, you know, just this is, again, you know, looking at stuff, looking at things, looking at, you know, it, it would almost be like if you were about to maybe purchase a home Per, you know, get a new apartment, get a new car, get it, and you're and you're going through the pros and cons of all of it. Okay, it, you know, do I? You know, this is very much that type of energy I'm picking up for you. Okay, pages, impulsive. You know, they they feel they feel very confident in themselves. Many times the pages do. So, logical, honest, impulsive, curious. Challenging information, delay, delays or changes to plans, truth delivered without tact. Again, you know, I do feel this very, I feel like your mind is going through all the scenarios. I don't feel like it's overloading, though. That's the thing that I'm trying to say. I guess that's what I'm trying to say is I feel like you have more a control over your thoughts it's not like you're waking up going, oh, you know, I wonder why the sky is blue. No, no, no. It's actually like, you know, your 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 thoughts are bigger than what they've ever been. Okay, I gotta, I gotta put it out there, and you have more um, focus on on these thoughts. Okay, let's go on and see what else we have here. Let's go on the next. The world, Archangel Michael. And this is, you know, this is power tarot card. This is one of those major arcana. Michael is the um, guardian. He is the protector. He is the warrior. And this is, again, you know, so with these two things, there's going to be some, ex even though, okay, challenging information. So Monday, Tuesday, you know, could be something that you start hearing more news. You could, you know, if this is about a job, is this about those house, that house or home that you're looking at? Is this about those cars? Is this about, you know, all of this information? But you're going to do, it's going to, you are going to go down that right path. You are going to choose whatever is right for you. These thoughts are so big, though. This, I mean, it's, it's so, it's, it's like you, you, you know, you, you're really buying into, and, and it's okay, it's good for you to be doing this. You're really buying in that into you know a a pathway for yourself, a better pathway for yourself. So a job well done, um, joy, contentment, and gratitude. The path towards enlightenment. Your next card, the page of water. Okay. Now again, water energy is Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and this is about um, you know emotions, fluidity, things. You know as the world turns as you know, as, as things go forward, you, again, this is a, this is, 
There's new coming to you. You are going towards that new. There is this really, um, the, I mean, again, this strong intellectual energy. It's like, okay, it's like you're not going to let the emotions rule you as much in, as you have in the past. You're going to, you know, there's many times that I talk about your mind, your heart, your spirit, or your, you know, intuition, and that these need to be balanced. And so many times, my Aquarians, you've been more in that emotional side, okay, that it's been more, that that's been ruling you. And this is, this is, it, it, you're not, you're not, it's not a, it's not, you're not becoming cold, okay? It's just that you're 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 thinking a little bit more. It's like you're, and I shouldn't say you're thinking a little more. It's like you're not necessarily you're not going to allow the emotions to rule you on this new pathway as much as it is you're going to think things through so much clearer, so much so much further than what you normally do. Okay, okay. So anyway, the page of water. Intuitive, sensitive, artistic, friendly. A new person enters your life. A relationship begins a new phase. Heightened psychic abilities. Now, again, whenever I talk about a relationship, new person, that's anything, you know, that work, job, career, personal, inter interpersonal, or intimate family, okay? So there's a new, something's new changing, and it's it's kind of like that, you know, you're, you're going to handle things differently, you're, you're not going to rely on older thought patterns. You're not going to rely on, you know, on how, you're not going to do it how you used to do it. So, now this is Monday, Tuesday. This, if this is more, you know, maybe these are what your resolutions are going to be. I don't, you know, I'm not quite picking, but it's like, you, there's the sense of, I'm going to think before I act. Okay? Okay. <laughs> So my Aquarians, if you enjoyed my reading, please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And my Aquariuses, besides wishing you a happy new year, a happy 2020, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.